<laughs> Tried to late call me. Get wrecked. <laughs> Get wrecked. Not only not late, but perfectly on time. In fact, right at the tick of 10. <laughs> hey, Threadnought, good to see you. Good to see you. I am the one who reacts to everything. Well, switching all this over. You're, th you're three seconds late. No, actually, I was five seconds early. <laughs> oh. But I know there is a bit of a warm up period for OBS to actually send out the broadcast, so that's why I start like right before it switches, or I try to. Mm. I want to talk about it, but I will talk about it at lunch. Well, let's just say, waking up and seeing that the Disney Corporation got completely BTFO'd in Florida is... Mwah. Holy shit. They got massacred in court. Florida absolutely destroyed the Reedy Creek District. Hey, it's gone. It, it does not exist anymore. Reedy, Reedy Creek is gone. Like, holy shit. They got, they got fucked. And it was so good. Oh. But yeah, we will talk about that on, uh, we'll talk about that uh, at lunchtime. Where, where there's more people. I mean, we can talk about it, like, with a bunch of people and then, you know, clowning on Disney. <laughs> Which is always a good pastime. Let's see. Would hammer throw be even worth it? Hmm. I was thinking getting piercing blow here because it bypasses all armor checks and getting something else. So I wonder if tornado jump would be worth it. the adults exist. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, we will definitely talk about it uh, for lunch. Because, my god, is it, is it funny? I don't even know. I don't even know the full extent of the shellacking Disney got. But let's just say, Disney admitted to a lot of illegal shit as part of the settlement agreement. And it doesn't give them criminal liability. Or, sorry, it doesn't give them um, criminal, uh, a, a, a pardon on criminal activities. So they actually have to worry that there are now criminal charges coming down. So that's being held, well, at least in the public, um, in the public settlement. There was no exemption to criminal acts that Disney committed. So, there's, they have the sort of Damocles over their head, as far as we know, unless there's a backroom closed door deal. They have the sort of Damocles over their head that there are criminal charges coming at some point. Because um, they admitted to a lot of criminal shit. Uh, they also lost their power plant. Um, their entire power plant contract has now been completely evaporated. So that's uh, that's at least, what, $20, $30 million that Disney lost right there. Not to mention, again, Reedy Creek is gone. They now have to go through a uh, different uh, district like holy shit I can't wait to talk about it I can't wait to talk about it <laughs> it should be fun oh yeah yeah that's that's about the best way to put it we will we will absolutely talk about it yeah it can damage all mid-air enemies it's okay yeah, tornado jump will be good. Um, save again real quick. Alright, I think we have one. Did we do all of them or do we have one left? Ain't gotta work tonight, nice. Let me know what your schedule is for next week, Itiko. 
let me know what your schedule is for next week, and then uh, I'll schedule the uh, bounty streams for then, and then we'll just do the normal, like, you know, trading off. Yeah, okay, there was one. <sighs> hey, a girlfriend, please come listen to my request. I'm in the storeroom deep in the cave on Keelhaw Key. Yeah, I know where the storeroom is. I know. At least we know a decent way to get there fast. Right? Sucks. But we know a way to get there. Oh, I also learned some interesting information about, uh, about Paper Mario series, and uh, the Mario Brothers series in general. Apparently, Luigi being super, like, aggressive towards Mario is more canon to how Mario and Luigi actually act in Japan than it is in the West. Mario and Luigi don't get along really well in, uh, in actual Japanese canon. They're actually like big rivals with each other. Whoops, wrong way. I instinctively went that way. No! No! They're not here! I gotta go the other way! No, it's right now. It's, it's both. It goes both ways. Mario treats Luigi like shit as well in uh, Japan, apparently. So Luigi always claps back at him. That's why, like, uh, one of the most famous ones, if you saw, uh, I forget what the game was called, but if Luigi wins it, Mario will come up to the winner's podium with Luigi on the winner's podium, and he'll stamp on his foot and, like, grind it into the ground because Mario's trying to humiliate him. Oh, fuck. Again, their relationship in uh, in the actual canon is pretty wild. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a tornado because there's literally nobody here. Good. Okay, I was hoping that was enough. Herd of Yoshi's to attack all ground enemies. Six FP, huh? Better be worth it. Yeah, just because Mario occasionally splashes Luigi with holy water or has crucifix hanging around doesn't mean he's being mistreated. Jesus! Alright, for 6 FP, what we got? Oh my god! Woo! Oh, I missed. Oh, come on! Both of those? I missed both? You know what, we have so many power blocks. I don't do anything. <laughs> Name some streams you've been on in Robin Dance Channel? I don't know if they'll still be saved. But we used, I used to do Secret World. Uh, oh, fuck, I should have paid attention to this! Re. Re. Oh, I didn't get the other thing, but... Yeah, I'm just gonna get power blocks used. Oh, I didn't get the thing either! Wow! I'm doing really bad when it comes to... 
Seriously? I got three! Three in a row! Oh, yes, please. Toss that up here. I'll toss it to him. Oh, hey, yeah, toss that up here. Woo! Only power block. Yeah, same. It's made me more interested in, like, dang, so... How, how does these play out and everything? And it's the same with, uh... Whoop, oh, boy, I forgot. First ones, we gotta just jump. It's the same with, uh, Wario and Waluigi. They're a lot nastier in, uh... In the Japanese versions. In Japan, um... The Mario series is a lot more, uh... Is a lot less kid friendly. Let's put it that way. The thing I hate the most about this is that this guy is all the way in the storage room. So we're gonna be, we're gonna be on a hell of a journey still. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's an understatement <laughs> from what I've seen. these brothers hate each other and their counterpart is a lot more uh, evil. Yeah, kind of. Oh, well, the Super Mario Brother movie sucked. Like, I, I hate to break it to you, that the Mario movie, the new one that came out, was really bad. Like, really bad. Yeah, I'm try- I'm try. But I always seem to mess up the one. Ah. Oh. Keeps going too fast. No, I deny you, witch. The new one was way too nostalgia baity, for sure. Oh, the terrible Bowser song. Bowser got done super dirty in the new movie. And of course, they had to make uh, Peach for a modern female audience, aka make her an insufferable fucking piece of shit. Double. Curious on the damage we do. Ah, I should have figured. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh my god. My fing my finger was like, ah, I don't like that. There we go. Yeah, piercing hammer real good on that. Ah! What? I... 
Wow! All the way back. Let's go, Drake. Fuck, we lost those coins. Yeah, he was in the movie a little bit. Not well, as much as you would hope. Okay. Um, we don't want you, we want... There was a Christian school that tried to relate to the young kids by putting bowels around a wall with a piano and replacing Peach is with Jesus, not realizing it means he wants to bang the Son of God. <laughs> yeah. It's a big bit of a bit of a whoopsie. Makes sense. We have one who's always in the limelight, and the other uh, pretty much lives in his brother's shadow. Yeah. Which is really unfortunate for Luigi, because Luigi. Luigi, I find to be the way more interesting of the two brothers. Always have. Ugh. <sighs> Um... Oh, I didn't get the stylish in. Nine, baby! nerd. Hey, thanks for taking up my trouble. All the way out here, too. I know it's far. Came out here to enjoy island life. But now that I'm here, I just feel lonely. There's no one to date. I mean, no one. I'm chatting up steam turtles here. So all I need you to do is introduce me to a nice girl. That's it. A girl, okay? This my type would be petite, younger than me, and pretty. Not drop that hot. Yeah, a cute little Goomba gal would be just perfect. Please help me, please. Hey, how's it going? Did you happen to find a cute girl for... Whoa, yeah, wow, yeah, she's cute. Really cute. And that ponytail, man. Perfect. Slam dunk, man. Yes, slam dunk. This may be a bit soon. I have to confess my love to this girl. Er, uh, hi! Do you believe in love at first sight, Angel? Because, you know, I do, and... What are you trying to say? Just spit it out! I love you! I think I've loved you since before I was born! Please, go out with me! Um, oh, jeepers, uh, this is awkward. I, um, I'm going out with Mario, honest. I'm sorry, you're really cute, though. What?! What? You have a boyfriend? Man, I've had enough of this. Peace! Thanks, I feel like I did some something totally brutal. You did, you lied to him! Oh, Mario, why don't you take this as a reward for dealing with that guy? Let's get moving. Wow. Whore! Whore! Die! Wench! <laughs> yeah, just say no, don't lie, you fucking asshole. Just say, sorry, I'm not interested. Oh, fuck. Slipped right in. 
Oh, those are the, those are the worst people. Those are the worst fucking people. Because they, they don't think about the other person. They just try to make it less awkward for themselves. Oh, I hate that so much. <sighs> Again, it's like, have a fucking spine. Just say, hey, I'm flattered, but uh, no thanks. I am not interested. Like, I appreciate you think I got game, but I'm not interested. That's all you gotta do. Just coming up with stuff is like, oh, I already have a boyfriend or a girlfriend or. Oh, fuck. I like the chat. I like the chat! It's all your fault! Um. Oh, shit. Ooh, close. Yeah, that kind of shit, that, that annoys the piss out of me the most. I really hate when people do that shit. Now you can post if you want. Post it in memes and shit posting. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, fuck you. I'm out! Thank goodness, though. That trouble is done with. We don't have to ever come back to Keel Hall Keys for the foreseeable future. Ten coins. Ah, uh, yep, lay down. Say so the Mario movie's the worst Illumination film? I don't know all of the Illumination films. They have a lot of bad ones, though. They have a lot of bad ones. Who's debating right now? <clears throat> Fuck. Hi, buddy. feel bad. I kind of wish that that wasn't a mechanic, but uh, it is, and it's some of the best healing and stuff you can get in the game. The first Despicable Me was alright. I don't remember. The second one, I don't remember that much. Like, don't they find, like, a, another woman who's, like, a mad genius? Like, and then that they get together or something like that? films. You need to hit it at least twice for 100% completion. Wow. I feel bad for him, too. It's like, man, why would the devs put that in there? Return from the cursed island and kill Hall Key with treasure, maybe? Nope. Alright, is this changed finally? Mustache guy's back from Keel Hall Key. I wanna go. Who cares if I get cursed? The guy who wants to make some easy money.
If you hit it enough, it dies. Oh my god. Well, there we go. That's the last time we're hitting it. Because that's hopefully the last time we visit Keel Hall Key. Ever. Ever, ever. <sighs> are, are you Mario? Did this email? Did, did you get this email? Look, technology freaks me out, so if you're not Mario, please destroy this email, okay? But if you are, thanks for saving my captured friends. I figured I'd share a hot tip with you as thanks, so here it is. There's still lots of treasure in Creepy Steeple. Of course, knowing you, you've probably already found it all. Uh, I'm so useless. But well, enjoy your not-so-useless adventure, uh, the Creepy Steeple Boo. Oh, that was him kind of trying to show you that that's where the recipe book is. Yeah, we already got that. All I ever think about is how this train cuts through the wind as it races across the plains. Like a torpedo on Earth, slicing through the relentless winds. Doesn't it just fire you up inside? I don't have the money yet, but my dream is to one day ride this train. This train is bound for luxurious, poshly heights. Will you be boarding today? Wonderful! If you don't mind, please allow me to check your ticket. Watch your step, please. All aboard! All aboard! <clears throat> mm. He's nice for an evil dead guy. Yeah, what exactly are boos, actually? Are they just their own species? Three days of excess. Mario's room. Aw, oh, yeah! The Excess Express! This is so deluxe, man! The three days of Posley Heights are gonna be over like that! Hey, you see that? Something on the floor. When did that get here? I get there. Don't go to Poshley Heights. Get off the train now, or sticky, yummy doom awaits it. Wow! What a freaky threat! You don't think this could be Beldum's work, do you? Remember this psycho is? You gotta figure that they're, they're on this train, right? We gotta get this nut before anything bad goes down on this train. Oh yeah, speaking of, I'm gonna just go take a nap. I can't even sleep in my bed. I can't sleep in my bed. Chungus! Mm, what would Big Chungus sound like? <laughs> hey, hello there. You know, I used to dream of one day getting to ride on this train. And now, I finally got a ticket. Dreams do come true. Holy shit, it's the Big Chungus fungus. I can buy this guy devouring whole species, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Hello. Oh! What do I have? Oh, not what I meant to do. I meant to do gear.
And... Here for sure. That'll work. Sweet! Now... I swear there's like a murder mystery thing here? Oh. Oh, Detective Penguin. Mm. Yes. I'm on my way back home. I've strayed so long, I've forgotten what it looks like. Oh, hold on. Oh! Hey! You look like some of the guy that owes me money, except he was green. Me? I have a very important deal to attend to once we arrive in Posh the Heights. I'm traveling on business, so everything goes on the expense account. Yes! <laughs> oh, it's the Vavon family. Oh, are they arguing again? Yeah, I'm Bob, and we're gonna get a birthday present for me, and it'll be cool. Are you jealous? We are in route to Pushley Heights to buy a birthday present for little Bob here. Ah, oh, my, my, my. They look like they're angry with each other. Oh, you are the champion of the Guts Pit, are you not? Yes, the Great Gonzales! Bound for Bushley Heights? Well, it's a certainly a fitting place for a celebrity like you. Yeah, there you go. Finally! The recognition I deserve. Hello to you and welcome to the Excess Express. I'm the conductor of this train. And I trust you must be Mr. Mario from Room 5? Make yourself at home, sir. What's that? Some sort of a sticky, yummy threat? I, I see. Good gracious me. If I hear anything else, I will let you know immediately. <clears throat> what? what are we doing together? Mm, yes. I could say without the slightest hesitation that this smells like a case to me. But what shall we call it? That is the question before us, yes? What to call it? Yes, the case of the pot of supper stew that vanished suddenly and mysteriously. Indeed, that will do nicely. No, you call it the Lost Supper. The Lost Supper! Oh my god, the title writes itself! Sheesh. Hmm. My dear train passengers, this is a full-fledged mystery. One that impacts you all. What? A mystery? <laughs> a mystery, you just said. And, uh, um, er, uh, exactly. What kind of a dish is that? I am known as Pennington. You likely would not guess it, but I am a detective. At the risk of immodesty, you might say I have a certain nose for these things. And this little conundrum, my dear fellow passengers, poses no challenge to me. Oh. The central clue of this case, and also the most vital one, as it happens, is that our perpetrator took the whole pot, stew and all. And this, esteemed friends, leads me to believe that the one responsible is you, you gluttonous woman, you underhanded cad, you bewitching wench! It was clearly the scullery maid! What? <laughs> what? Me? Are you totally cuckoo? I have, like, no idea what you're talking about! Um, pardon me, sorry. Please accept my apologies, my dear woman, you ugly wench. I felt I needed to practice my accusation skills. You understand? Yes, sorry. Hmm, very good. Now, let us get serious, shall we? This, I believe, will be a case worthy of my intellect. Hmm, yes. Let me get this straight. Hmm, wait, hmm. Let me, uh, let me get this straight. So, what we know so far is that we don't know who the culprit is. And, uh, I, I guess that's about it, right? 
Hmm, kind of dude bro -y. Whoa. Ah, this scene is for total squares. Forget you guys, I'm going back to my room. Hmm. You there. In a bit of a hurry to get back to your room, eh? You, sir, are highly suspicious. I've just broken this case. Oh, excuse me. The true culprit, I believe, is Zip Toad, the actor. Z Zip Toad, the actor? No way, Mr. Detective Person. You're just making stuff up, you you Tweety Geezer. T Tweety Geezer? Geezer? I can't say I deserve such a verbal thrashing. But well, then, who did do it, hmm? Hmm. This puzzle deepens with every confounding step. Wow. 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 <laughs> okay. He's an idiot. Yeah, he's just ca casually thrown out accusations. Oh, wow. Look what I found. Hmm. It's almost like there's a clue here. A clue. A clue. Wow, this looks like spilled stew on the carpet. Nasty. I almost stepped on it. We can just follow the trail of the thief, don't you think? And you know what? It might even be the nut who made the sticky yummy threat. What makes me say that? If you steal, you probably do other bad stuff, right? I wonder if it's Fatty McFattingston! Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you want? Sorry about that. Know that were you just saying uh, a pop for the kitchen? Oh, I get it. Food gets stolen. You blame the chubby guy. Not nice. What? Come stew on the floor outside? No, I wouldn't know anything about that. No, people spill stuff. And there's nothing in the drawer, so no need to look. You won't find a thing. So, gourmet food magazines here. One of them is an issue devoted to the food of the Excess Express. Large photo of the chef she meet on the cover. This one was just blinding. There's something under the magazines. Wow! The murder weapon! When you killed the stew, did you at least let it say its last words? Or did you just scarf it all down, fatty? Oh. I'm sorry. I ate it all. It was me! So, you were so enamored of the stew that you wanted to steal it to devour more? And you stole the entire pot when the chef was chopping shallots? Answer! Yes, yes, that's right. I'm so sorry, but it was a brief vote of weakness. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Justice has been served. Very satisfying. May this terrible crime never recur. And you, my dear sir. Yes, you with the unkempt facial hair. My keen soothing instincts identified you as the correct person to call the ruffian. Now, about that note in your room. Yes, I know of it. As the lone detective on the train, the conductor confided in me. But we cannot speak here. Find me in room six, so that we may discuss this in private. Oh, and uh, please return the pot to the chef, if you would. Didn't even let the stew have its last words. What's wrong with you? That stew had a family. There was a soup at home. Oh, disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. <laughs> Big chungus fungus over there. Just couldn't help himself. He was so fat, he's just like... <laughs> So you found the beef, or wait, I mean, the thief. I am joyful. Uh, anyway, didn't we do like something weird for Ah, sir, uh, you're, you're the hero of my world. You have even brought my pot. It's empty, of course, but it's mine and I love it. Thanks to you, for me. Here's just a little taste of my powerful gratitude. Please, take it. Oh, uh, why must I butcher this language so, so shameful? Please take it, I mean. Oh, please fake it. Yeah, hell yeah. Slurpees! Slurpees! Slurpees!
Yeah, at least it didn't gobble the entire pot down. Aha! I have been waiting! I was rather impressed with your work on this last case, I must admit. However, I do not think the one you apprehended is our sticky, yummy malcontent. I have deduced this from the lack of any incriminating clues in his room. In any case, I must say, I believe you have a certain knack for detective work. So it is decided, then. I shall take you on as my new assistant. To reiterate, my name is Pennington. I am a detective from Poshley Heights. I am known in some circles as the Penguin with the Improbably Large Brain. I am sure you have heard of me. So that is all I will say on the subject. And as for your name, wait. I demand you do not tell me. I shall deduce your identity. That mustache. That nose. Ho, ho, ho. All too easy. You, sir, are quite obviously the famed Luigi, are you not? Ha <laughs> get fucked. No need to introduce yourself. I know all about the famous Luigi. Now, about this threat. Our man has declared his intent to yummify the train. A sticky, tasty explosion. That family of bombs, they are definitely suspect. Now, Luigi, we will reduce this case to rudimentary facts and deduce the truth. Hang on, I, I need to try something. I need to see if I can fix your brain. Hi <laughs> now, profiling the bombs. Oops, not this one. Next one. Mom and Dad are fighting about what to get me for my birthday. I'm so bored. I wish I had brought my GBA. I think we should get the little bug, the Advanced Learner's Classic Series of Bobbery. Two, mm, two words. Cheap and boring. Think more luxurious, dear. Perhaps a car or a house. Bob is too small for such things, Gold Bob. Stop thinking of your own social status. Status. Status would be better for someone snooty. He needs something that will further his education. Not spoil him, honestly. I don't want any of that stuff they're talking about. Hey, mister. Are you a detective now that you quit being a champion? Well, so, think you can detect what I really want for my birthday? Sure, I'm a bro. Really? Cool. Okay, if you bring me what I really want, then I'll give you something in return. Okay. Do we get a hint at all? Okay, then. Here's a hint. Starts with an A. Got it? Alright. Here's your second hint. Starts with A. It's a certain person's autograph. Now you've got it, don't you? A divorce. <laughs> okay, uh, it's gonna be the actor, right? What's the actor's autograph? Where even is the actor's room? Let's go find him. Luigi! He's clearly talking about the Luigi! I know, Luigi's so smart. Oh, nope, not her. the little pub kid won as a present. Uh, well, I'm sure he'd be stoked to have an autograph of mine, right, guy? Oh, man. Don't they all? I can't do it, unfortunately. I only sign for chicks. 
How do we... Maybe? Hmm. How? Hmm, talk. Well, hello there, you fine, fine specimen of a man. You're marvelous, dear. You solved a rather tough little mystery, didn't you? Yes, very well done. You're so ruggedly smart. Perhaps you could help me with something as well. I'm sure I'll help. Oh, how absolutely lovely. Now listen well. I'm looking for a gold ring that I lost somewhere on this very train. You please haste the search along for me, you boldly brilliant man. See any cracks or anything? What's in here? A save room. Oh! Riding this train during the sunset is the high point of every day for me! So let's all hear it for the Excess Express! Huzzah! Huzzah! Alright, well, there you go. He's gonna be very happy. He's very, very happy. The door may not be open while the train is in motion. Let me out! There's all the, the, the crazy people here! I think that would be a really tough case, right? Um, a, the guy is a mur the murderer is just somebody who did it just because they literally have no association with the uh, victim. They just did it because they felt like it. So I totally bagged that chubby guy in record time. I was way impressed. Hey, come to think of it, I can use your skills. Can you help me? R really? Wow, okay, so I lost these shell earrings that my ex-boyfriend gave me. And they're like all full of memories and stuff. I really need them back. Could you maybe look for them or something? Please? So we have multiple... Missing items. Yeah, everybody, indeed. Be uh, needing help. Hey, everybody. I bet everybody has something for us. Oh, shit, not the detective's room. No! Alright, well, hold on. Several detective novels here. Right. Make sure. I was really looking forward to plopping that stew on my expense account. Oh well, I'll just order the next most expensive thing on the dinner menu. Oh, no he doesn't have anything, okay. I can hear everything the family's fighting about loud and clear from out here. One thing I heard was cute. That boy dreams of being a train engineer someday. What an interesting dream for a rich little kid like that. <laughs> Say, you don't suppose that bub wants something from a person he admires? Whatever it is, we have to find it quickly or we'll end up yummy and sticky. Oh, okay. He wants it from the train engineer. Okay, we're going to go out to the, we're gonna go to the front room.
trains are pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. I have only ever ridden on a tram, though. I would genuinely love the train. Oh, the the funniest train I've ridden on, well, tram, technically, um, was the one in the uh, Atlanta airport. The Atlanta, Georgia airport, because the airport is so fucking big, they need to have trains that take you to each of the terminals because they're so far apart, right? And you, I got on the... I got on it, and it's like... Now departing in three, two, one. I'm like, why is there a countdown? And it takes off and it shoots off. Like, it doesn't still go slow start because they need to get you to where you need to go fast. So it's just like, three, two, one. Boosh! <laughs> it just goes. <laughs> it's like, oh shit. You want my autograph, sir? Oh, it's for little bub? Well, yes, of course. Here you are, sir. Yeah. Gosh, I've never given out an autograph before. I feel fantastic. I will murder you on that hill. I will murderize you on that hill. You need the good old street trolleys. That's, that's the height of public transport. Street trolleys, baby. So, did you bring me the thing I want most? Hey, yeah, bingo, mister. That's just what I wanted. You're a good detective. Here's something for you, just like I said. Wow, a shi fucking shine sprite. Thanks for the autograph. I'll take good care of it, I promise. Meanwhile. <laughs> I pulled a star piece out of their out of their drawers. <laughs> just yoink! Okay, it's nighttime. Can we find uh, the stuff we need at nighttime? So we need a gold ring and a pearl. Uh, and what was it? Pearl earrings? Hmm. Wait, is that just a... Is that just a graphics glitch, or is that a thing? It's a graphics glitch, okay. Hmm. So thus becomes the question. Okay. Where... I heard a pearl necklace, a pearl earrings, and a gold ring bee. I'm trying, I'm trying to check all the drawers. It's all cosmetics. I'll check the actor's room real quick. Glossies featuring zip toad inside. Mm -hmm. I don't know if they would. I don't know if the mouse companion would help. Hmm. I don't think there's anything near here, sweetie. Okay, there's something here. Can't get back there. I'm just not switching levers here. Can't jump at it. Hmm. 
following day, there will be a brief stop at Riverside Station for refueling, followed by the arrival at our final destination of Poshley Heights on day three. Hmm. Oh, it's a butt stop thing? Oh. Hey! Okay. Neato. Well, we, we need to find the things, right? Or is it not possible to find the pearl earrings and the ring yet? Yeah, it's still technically the same room. Still there one. Hey! How did I flip the one? How? There! I say, how did we flip it last time? Let's see if she says anything else about where she last was that maybe? No. Now, if you please, I must begin to prepare the evening orders. Odors. Oh no, curse this tongue of mine. I mean the evening hors d'oeuvres. Now you know what's funny about that word? My sister, when she was young, she saw that word and she called them horde ovaries. Horse ovaries. I was like... But yep, that's exactly how that's said. Don't let anybody tell you different. find the pearl earrings and the uh, ring yet. Okay. Shell earrings. Sorry, my bad. Shell earrings and gold ring. I don't think we can find them on this first night. Got everything else too, so. Yeah. Now I shall bring out the speed demon so we can get through all the cars fate easier. Have your HP and FP. Oh, that wasn't. Wasn't actually nap time? Thought we might be like coming up to the morning. Oh, uh, I need to go to the penguin? Mm. Or the guy at the back of the train? Okay. Let's go. Okay. Mr. 
Mario! Glad you spoke to me. I just remembered something suspicious. I myself one blanket short when I was handing them out to the passengers. I had the last passenger my own blanket to make up for it, but it's vexing. I have exact blanket counts. It means someone came on board without a ticket. That stowaway just might be your suspect, Mr. Mario. Only that, but if I don't get my blanket back, I'll be too chilly to sleep tonight. If you can look for the unticketed passenger, get that blanket. I thank you. Call me Blanket P.I. Honestly? Great, thanks. Well, I have to keep watch here, but I'll be waiting for the good news. Do you have a ticket? Where is your ticket? Tickets, please. Right. Try to get all my paperwork done t today so I can enjoy myself tomorrow. So, uh, could you just stay out of my way for a while? What's this? There's an unticketed passenger, just as I suspected. Conductor was one blanket short, eh? And we are hunting a lone intruder. I would definitely rule out the family in cabin eight. Rudimentary, my boy. That's the only hint I will give you today, my sleuth apprentice. You must strike out on your own, with a little nugget of investigative wisdom. Of course, I have other hints to share, if I so choose. Oh, truly. For example, the unticketed passenger is without a doubt our yummy, sticky suspect. What's this? That's not ticks. Uh, oh, shit. There. Okay. Hmm. This room's empty, so... Yeah, exactly. I was going to say, are you too fat for one blanket? Hey, guy, getting falsely accused is a bummer, right? Don't I know it? Actually. Oh, thought for sure that might be the solution that there is a hidden room here. The noise in the room next door a little while ago. Weird ones. But when I looked in there, it was empty. I was like, okay, that was freaky. And when I came back, I heard the noises again. Really spooked me. You mind checking that room for me? Oh, that's easy. Okay, Vivian. Vivian time. You found me. Well, as you see, I'm a ghost. I'm cursed to haunt this place. A blanket? 
Well, yes, the conductor did leave one here and realize that I'm a ghost. A yummy, sticky threat? No, I left no such thing. I can't even hold physical objects like pen and paper. What? You just want the blanket then? Well, I'll tell you where it is. If you do something for me, what do you say? Fine. All I need is your life. No, just kidding. Actually, I passed away in this cabin many years ago. But I think my luggage is still in the baggage car here. Inside my bag is a diary I kept since my earliest childhood days. My fear that someone would find and read it has kept me tied to this world. I can't leave this room, so can you please find it and bring it here? If you do that, I'll show you where the blanket is. And don't you even dare read my diary! Because if you do, ho oh, 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 a horrible fate awaits you! Uh oh. Uh oh! I'm calling Luigi! Luigi, there's the ghost problem! Oh, okay, bro. I get on it. Did you find it? What? A ghost? Yeah. And he won't give you the blanket unless you get his diary from the baggage car? I, I see. Well, go on in. You don't say no to ghosts. Probably other stuff, but now we know there's a thing in here. Hang on, let's do... Er, you actually. Ragged Diary. Maybe. Nope, up close. Nope, far away. Nothing in between. Hmm. Hmm. I'll climb the boxes? Oh, shit. Nope, can't do that one. These ones? Oh wait, I see what you're saying. Behind that box right there. But how... How do we get to that one? Come on. Wait, you think there's a way to climb up in here?
I can get up here, I would be able to do it, but I can't. Yeah, Drake could, like, again, if I could get here, I could use Drake to get to here. Remember, Drake can't go this way. He can't go up and down. He can only go side to side when you're when you're on him. So, see, can't go up, can't go down. He can only go side to side. See, I see that pathway, that passageway. I don't know how to get there. Yeah, I can't get up higher, though. See, the Drake. Because remember, Drake can't go up in distance at all, either. When you do... When you do Drake, he stays at the same level you're at. That's why I'm like... I mean, if I could get up on top of this crate... Then I could go across with Drake. And you see, I just can't get on that crate, either. Oh, no, 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 yeah, I'm not after the Ragged Diary. I was after this now, to get up here. I've already got the Diary thread, not? Yeah, you missed that. Well, you already grabbed the Diary. Yeah, so. I was after the ex exploration thing. Yeah, yeah. Okay. D did you find the Diary? Wonderful. I knew you would. Now, I cannot leave my post. Please return the diary while I stay here. But I would like to see what's written in it. Why does Capcom take the award for most useless microtransactions? I don't know. What do you mean by... Like, what did they get recently? Nope, not checking what's in the diary. Yep, not happening. Did you find my diary? Yes, this is my diary. Very well. Your blanket is right here. You were very wise not to read my diary, friend. <laughs> if you had read it, you might be a spirit like me right now. But now I can go peacefully on from this world. Thank you so much. You'll probably never meet me again in this world. Fare thee well. Uh, he drops the diary on his way. No, my diary! Hey. Well, actually, maybe not. I've been here so long, I've gotten kind of used to it. Wallpaper's so great. Maybe I'll stay here just a little while longer. I can leave whatever, so that's all there is to it. Oh, ho. He did it. Yeah, I think I need the super jump. Here's your blanket. Tell Mr. Mario, 
I just gotta go. Oh, thank you so much. Now I'll be comfortable tonight. Of course, our yummy and sticky mischief maker is still at large. Oh, hey, before I forget, it's just a gesture of my thanks. Shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Alright, here you go. Toss that at you. It's getting late, Mr. Mario. Perhaps you should just turn in for the night. If anything happens, I'll report it to you immediately. Do not worry about a thing. For I am the conductor of the XS Express. Run! It's trying to come back. Oh, hang on, wait, wait. Man, it's not really like that. I see. So it was not, in fact, our yummy, sticky suspect. Just as I suspected. The mystery deepens. It's getting rather late. Let us turn in and work on this case tomorrow. A moida! There's been a moida! Come quick! Hey, the conductor can handle the train, so let's grab a few winks, huh? Hey, Grinus. Welcome, welcome. Hey, morning, Mario. You been to the dining car yet today? I can't believe I stole that pot of stew. It was like a bad, chattery nightmare. Thanks that incident. Cook and I are pals now. Isn't life weird? I it was so obsessed with my cooking. I, I had to become friends with him. Clearly, he has a good taste. Well, hello there. You cute, cuddly bear of a man. You, you're delightful, dear. Have you found my gold ring? Don't grow desperate now. I'm quite sure you'll be able to find it. Mm. 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 He's got different dialogue, so. Oh. The actor is not here. He's been moited. I know it. Moida, moida on the train. Engineer, pull the train over! There's been a moida! <laughs> Good morning to you, sir. Did you sleep well? We will be making a stop at Riverside Station today. You'll love it, I assure you. Moida, moida, oh bloody moida! Oh no, an email! Oh no! Read this. Oh no! Report today. Local mystic Merluvli was taken to the hospital today, followed quickly by hordes of concerned fans. Luckily, according to a spokesperson for the hospital, Merluvli uh, suffered from nothing more than a severe case of indigestion caused by a wild binge on eight shroom steaks. The divine, the divine diviner exclaimed that her aura was brimming with the power of steak. Well, this reporter can't help but wonder why she failed to predict the gas, <laughs> gastrointestinal uh, adventure in the first place. Time, let's head to Keel Hall Galleria. 
We are proud to toast the entrepreneurial spirit shown by the managerial team who brought free commerce to this deserted island. I really wanted to do something that had never been done, gushed the unsinkable property, uh, proprietor and former flight fan, fight fan. So call me the Invincible Shopmaster. From now on, I'm 100% serious. Print that. We wish him all the success that he can grab with two hands and wrestle to the mat. Listen up, rookies, because here's another intermediate level recipe. Today's dish is the single serving peach tart. Take a peachy peach, add cake mix, stir, and bake. Try that at tea time, rookies. Okay. All right. Good morning. So any chance you've seen my shelly rings anywhere? Nope. Hello, it's a good feeling. I, I, I can't do voices for these guys. Today, my, my voice memory is just awful. Hello, it's a good feeling today. Isn't it, friend of mine? Yes, a delicious day. I will make food so delicious, it will make the day bad. <laughs> He's gone mad with power. Help. He just keeps staring at me. He keeps staring at me, and he's just like... Man, you know, if if I could take over the world, I would do it in a heartbeat. And I'm just like, I don't, I don't really, I don't really vibe with that man. I don't know what you're doing here. Okay, there we go. Hey, Bizzle. Welcome. Up. Hello, Detective Mario. Saw no one suspicious during the night. We'll be stopping at the Riverside Station today, around dusk, I believe. Okay. Good morning, mister. Thanks for the autograph yesterday. Little Bub sure had been in high spirits since yesterday. I wonder why he's so happy. Top of the morning to you, Gonzales. I'm afraid you saw us at our arguing worst yesterday. I feel rather ashamed. Oh. The mouse and the actor are missing. You know what this means? Drake. Drake. It's a love affair. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Scandalous. <gasps> we found him! The love affair is broken apart! There's a tryst between the mouse and the detective! Ah, my dear Luigi, your timing is impeccable. A new case has arisen. Now then, Mr. Businessman, please explain the facts to my assistant, Luigi. Oh, okay, okay, here's the deal. When I woke up this morning, my briefcase was gone. Contained all the contracts for our next deal. Even our new product prototype. If I don't recover it, I'll lose my job at the least. No, no. Calm yourself. The next part is vital. So tell Luigi very slowly. Uh, of course, of course. The company's new product is Nitro Honey Syrup. Used properly, it's an amazing product that can even raise the dead. But if mixed with the calcium from a seashell and a bit of gold... Well then, the results are explosive. The resulting goo blast would immobilize everyone here in a sticky yet yummy shellac. If it's fallen into the wrong hands, well, I could lose my more than my job. Let's examine these facts, shall we? Someone has stolen your briefcase. Though you definitely had it yesterday. And the train has not stopped at all in the intervening time. I have it! Rudimentary, my dear Luigi! Rudimentary! The thief is still on the train! Aha! Luigi, have you spoken to the waitress and the lady in cabin two? They have both lost something on this train. Waitress lost shell earrings. And the lady to toodles 
lost a gold ring. Luigi, the same person who stole those objects also has the nitro honey syrup. It could make this goo blast. It could carry out the threat in the note. So it is simple, Luigi. You must find that thief. We must apprehend the suspect before this dastardly plan is put into effect. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Conductor! Conductor! This is the baggage car. As I believe you well know, uh, no passengers allowed. Oh, okay. Well, I was going to tell you that there's a bottom aboard the train. That's okay. It's just gonna be an earth shattering kaboom, and then we're all gonna be stuck in sticky yet yummy uh, gooeyness. Did you see that zip toad come to last night's dinner? I really have to say, he's like way cuter on the big screen. Maybe they all are. Hello, it's a good feeling day, isn't it, friend of mine? Yeah, it's a delicious day. I will make food so delicious it will make the day mad. Is Luigi doing something nefarious? No. The detective is so dumb that he thinks we're Luigi. Woo! Man, the, uh... Game's having some struggle bus, so... Uh... Okay, yeah, yeah. Hello there, you cute little bad. Oh, hang on, we already done this. Okay, so we need to find the actor. The actor's missing. Oh, oh! Got a vital paper. Okay. Looks like something very important and complicated. I don't know. I don't want to take the. Wah! Did you see? Did you see that? Wallpaper went neon. We've gone so fast. We've gone to neon. Well, it's never done the neon thing. It's done the, the other, like, corruptions. Not neon. Neon is, in fact, a new one. Have you stumbled upon any new clues? What is this paper? Hmm. What sort of clue is this supposed to be? Ah! It's one of the contracts for my upcoming business deal. What? I mean, yes, just as I suspected. Luigi, where did you find this very important clue? Cabin 1, you say? Yes. Zip Toad's room. A place I have long suspected. Come to think of it, I do not believe I've seen him today. Perhaps he is hiding somewhere on the train. Always wants to bed. Very well, my dear Luigi. Find that Zip Toad. Oh, not good. Not good. If I don't find that thing, I'll be sacked for sure. Oh, did it? Lots and lots and lots of backtracking in this section. Lots of it. Oh, oh. There's a wallpaper change, I 
do. Who are you, sir? You sleep well? We'll be making a stop at Riverside Station today. You'll love it, I assure you. Cloud Lady? Cloud Lady? Oh, companion. Talk about ghost, flurry. If anybody sees... Hey, wait, wait, wait. Maybe now the wallpaper thing we were talking about will be there? Right? Maybe now? Ghosty friend. Whoa! Oh, the corruption's getting worse. I am gonna have a couple burritos uh, for lunch, and a, these are gonna all go in the air fryer. A couple burritos and a bunch of. Uh, what the, ooh, back in my room. Could this be another clue? A clue! A clue! This paper's just like that last one. Suspect must be in here somewhere. Yeah, man, the this thing does not like the train at all, does it? Hello, friend. It seems that there's someone in your room. Heard some rustling sounds in there a minute ago. Zow! Where'd you come from? Don't be catching me that easily, guy! As long as you can't get out of the room, that's all that matters. Gotcha! Yowch! So this was our man all along. Pretending to be zip toed, I see. All the while pilfering things from others to aid your evil plan. Hmm, yes, this is all just as I had deduced. You all along, you were a fake. Yes, a discolored nostril hair tipped me off. Not only that, but I knew that you were the one who threatened Luigi. Curses! Almost got away with it by getting off at the Riverside Station, too! Yes. 
You played a daring and invest an ingenious little game, my false friend. But the jig is up now, fiend. And uh, the good people on this train are now safe. It's correct, sir. No one escapes from the improbably large brain. Hmm. Well, yes, in any case, at least return what you have stolen, Fink. Bleh! Ah! My precious briefcase! Is, is Nitro, honey, super safe? Oh, thank you! Thank you! Thank the stars, it's safe! Now I will get the sack! A rendezvous with disaster was diffused by my most rudimentary of deductions. Bing bong, bing bong! Attention all passengers! Oh, you. Uh, attention all passengers! This train will soon make a brief scheduled stop at Riverside Station! I need to refuel. Hey! Hey, I think that's slick! You think you can hold me? No way! Veldum would flip if I let that happen! The whole zip toad thing was just a means to an end! It's me, suckers! Dupless! Veldum's plan to goify Mario didn't exactly work, so I'll be cutting and running now! I'll leave the rest of Beldum. See ya, suckers! What, so now you're just gonna uh, let everybody know your name? You idiot. Look at this kid. Oh my! We're leaving the train. My day's going pretty well. How about yours, Frank? Ooh, hang on, can I climb it? That would've been, that would've been fun. All right, what's over here? Nothing. Wow. Wow! It's so super cool looking. I want to drive it right now. So, little Bob really likes trains, does he? Why does one buy a train? Oh no. Oh no. What do we do? Someone's looked at the drawbridge. Train can't leave the station like this. Saw a suspicious looking shadowy person wearing a hat going to the station. Must have gone down to the bridge control room to flip the switch there. That switch hasn't been used so long, I don't know where the control room is. So, um, probably against protocol to ask a passenger to do this, but since you Really? Since you are the famous Mario and all, could you go find and throw that switch? Maybe? Really? That would be super. Well, here's the station key. Oh, thank you so much. Oof. I've been cooped up in there breathing stale air too long. I wanted to go out and take a walk so I could build up an appetite for dinner. Yes, I'm sure you did. This is the Riverside Station. We stopped to refuel. There's a quaint drawbridge here from when pleasure boats cruised the canal. But it hasn't been used since the canal was dried up and turned to pasture. Ah, oh, my dear Luigi. Our suspect was not only a fake zip toad. He was some monstrous being in a white sheet, which was exactly as I suspected. Too bad he gave us the slip like that. Though, he was a rather slippery sort. We could have questioned him about all of that Belden business. He's an idiot. He's an idiot. He's an idiot! Ooh! Ooh! I want it! I want it! Remember to always return the control room key to the office. Elevator key. 
Oh, the elevator key. Oh, well, pff, that's fucking... I thought it was. All right, be gone, Flurry. We don't actually need you. Oh, actually, wait, wait. I probably want Goombella in case there's any like shenanigans. Wow. I like the trains. Ah! I should have read chat. All right, tattle for me. Rough puff. Don't confuse them with dark puffs. Oh, I don't think the world would end if you did confuse them, but anyway. Looks like she has seven, attack is four, defense is zero. Hey, swoop at you or... Hey, swoop at you or charge the cells with electricity before unleashing lightning. Oh, and if you touch them while they're charged, you'll get a shock. How much does it... Land on a foe, press A, then the buttons you see. Oh. Uh, hmm. Doesn't do that much damage. The super hammer isn't that good, honestly. My opinion. Well, I need to try to do seven damage a turn, so... Oh, I made it to nine! Yeah! Get into the the half of it. Nope. More coins? Coins! Ah! Gotcha. Gotcha, you little shite. Oh, okay. We'll try the tornado thing now. Try. Oh my god! What? Oh, it switches immediately. Okay. First, let's ground pound you. Because I don't want you using that item. He's dizzy. Oh, I didn't get it. Fuck. Oh, dizzy and fogged. Nice. This will be great. Oh my god, he actually hit. 
Drake, color me impressed. You got dizzied and fogged, and you managed to hit anyways. Hell yeah. Well done, sir. Oh, fuck. Okay. I see. Oh, fuck! Why? I I specifically was waiting for that and I still jumped at it like Oh, that goes double. Fuck. Okay, can't deal with that one. Got it. They go together. Not that one. This one. Made it anyways, baby! What a fucking contraption! Sheesh! Look at this place! Are you serious? Oh. Yeah, all of this just for one bridge. Ah, oh, a bit much, don't you think? Got it! Oh, I wonder if... Hang on, wait. I wonder if... Okay, Koops would have reached as well. Okay, cool. So you actually could have made that easier just by having Koops do it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, actually, you know what I should do? It'll hurt, but... Poison Pokey. Okay. Eight, tax four. Slowly drain. Yep, that's fine. Okay. So now we know for the future. Oh, I didn't get the thing, damn. I tried. Actually, I'm real bubbery. How explosive are you at the moment? Seven! Damn! Almost! Almost can one-shot them! Ah, we're almost there for that level up, baby! Oh, I didn't get the nice. Wow. What? They froze him. Yeah. 
froze him again! What is happening? It's all rigged! It's been all rigged in our favor! Oh, I didn't get the other stylish. Damn. Nine points, baby! Alright. Eight and above. That's what we need. What? Why is that here? Oh! Tasty. Woo! Oh, come on! God, he turns so fast. Oh. Oh, shit. Hold on, Drake. I don't think it's gonna be enough. What stylish, baby? Ah! Well, there we go. <sighs> really? You tease? You absolute tease? Oh, come on. That didn't land on him? <clears throat> oh. Oh. Um... I can only go up to six damage, though. Mm. Okay. Playing the cursor with the good panels and press A. All right. I see, I see how it works now. Okay. <clears throat> Stampede! Damn! said you mentioned something being rigged in a desert setting from where you're sitting this must uh like a 24 care run of bad luck but i ain't no fink oh no 24 care run of bad luck all right more flower points and then we'll start working on the badge more bobber That was, indeed, a massive amount of damage. Oh! Dang, I got to eight. Nine was the best one I've done so far. Niced it. Oh, I didn't get the double. Come on. Ow. Shite. 
I see it. Hello there. Increase max HP by five. Hell yeah. Hell, yeah, well, I mean, we're definitely doing more badge points when we get the next one. I think we have plenty of uh, flower points now. 25 feels like a good number given how much our skills cost. Nice. Okay, well, I could jump on that. They can't. Hmm. Oh, shit. No, wrong one. All ground enemies. All enemies. Rally wink. Or, or maybe I don't need to. Okay. Head bonk. 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 Before I time that. Head bunk. Yeah, that's what my plan was. What? I say normally they come at you when they do that. Turned to sender and I did half his health and damage. He's like, bonk. Nope, get out of here. <sighs> More coins, eh? No, it's a moose! It's a moose! Oh, fuck. Ah! 
was in the garbage. these uh these quick fights that are giving me lots of star points see you garbage mushroom shown. So many of them. I want to because we're getting uh, good EXPs. did eight damage. Oh, so that is the way we're supposed to go. Okay. Cool. Oh, Nelly. Yeah, poor Wacka. I'm not going back there. We're not we're not harming him again. Okay, you wanna go this way? 
way. How do I get further? This fence. Do you do anything? Nope. Checking your fist does anything? Nope. Okay. Looks like we can come in from the other side, though, with the uh, vent. Oh, let's keep you. Really? Yeah, that is weird. What is what is happening here? There we go. Let's say. Oh, I didn't get the double stylish, damn. Oh! What the fuck? Oh, uh, didn't get it there either. <laughs> there you go. Let's try three. Ten. One. Weird. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, come on. We better get the high jump now. Ultra Boots! Hey again, Toadette! It's nice to see you again! Why do you get the Ultra Boots? Now your jump attack power will go way, way up! And you can use a new jump technique, too! Let's practice it right now! A little hard, but I know you'll get it! Hold down A and rotate to make your body fold up! At least A to do a giant spring jump! Okay. Help you reach new areas since you can grab pipes above you. Okay. Neato. <clears throat> Alright, I got it. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I see. Hey, I'm gonna go 
go back this way again real quick. Because we can do two things. We can do coops, or we can just do this. Nice! One. Oh, I mean, I guess we could just go here. But there's a obvious thing right there, right? So how do we get in this with our roly poly foldy? Just said dressing? I don't know. That's pretty suspicious. You might be right, though, because look, aren't those books? Those are books. Okay. Yeah, you might be right. Hey, at least now we got the super jump. Or the spring jump is more accurate to say, but yeah. Why? Thank you. Oh. Maybe something up there. There's a badge in this room? Oh. Oh, joy. That's what I want to hear. Hey, let me guess. It's down here, isn't it? We just have to go one of the other paths. I'll give one shot at it. So, not that path. We need to go down on one side. So, there's only one other path, it looks like. No. Okay. Nope, there it is. Alright, he's attacked by one, but dropped his defense by one. Hmm. Might be worth it. Uh, there we go. We go this way. Yeah, okay. Got it. Yeah, exactly. We might have that already. Um... Yeah. Well, maybe that is, we might have it already to uh, do the thing. Okay. Okay. No! Don't go in it immediately! Mario. Mario! You son of a bitch! Well, those little monsters. You think these weirdos flipped the switch? Let's hurry up and find it so we can switch it back. No. How 
I just wanted to turn the elevator on. I didn't realize that he was just going to immediately jump into it and be like, Hey, let's go. Like, no, let's not. Let's do two things first. Let's be smart. Okay, right here. There we go. Now, let's go. Let's see. If we put on... We don't have a way to do the one thing yet. What if we said a hammer time? What if we do this? Nice. Kaboom! Sus right there. Called it. I thought it was actually going to be a fight fight. Probably is going to be one here soon. This bridge station is way over-engineered. Oh, here you go. Hey, thanks a lot, Mario! Now we'll get you guys rolling. Day is just passing you on by. Hurry! All aboard, everybody! Have a good trip! Give me email. What is it? Okay. Sup, dog? Yo, G Many. It's me, King K. Your homie from the Glitz Pit. I know you remember me, dog. How you doing? Why are you off KOing fools left and right? Somewhere else? I'm still living large in the minor league. I'm keeping busy. You know how it is. I gotta thank you again for convincing me to stay, dog. You fired me up good. So are we ever gonna chill again? Or what? Or are we just gonna meet in the ring? Careful, dog. Next time you front on the King K, I'm gonna be way, 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 way better. Keep it real, King K. All aboard! Alright. Let's go! Attention all passengers! Thank you for riding the XS Express! Our next stop is our last, Poshley Heights! Alright, let's go return everything to everybody.
have you found my gold ring, you mystery sniffing master? Yes, it's definitely the ring I lost. Thank you, you glorious creature. I knew you would find it without fail. It's merely a trifle, but please take this as my honest thanks. Ooh, 30 bucks. And do take care. Ooh, 30 bucks. Yeah, 30 bucks is 30 bucks. I don't know what you're complaining about. I will be. I don't know if Total let me pass yet. Because storage department's not for, uh, for passengers, right? We'll see. Oh! Did you find them? My shelly rings? Ah. Oh, there they are! These are my earrings! Thank you so much! Hey, before I forget, take this as my thanks! You're like the nicest old mustachioed overall wearing guy I've ever met! Ooh, what's her dinner, by the way? Hello! The mushrooms in tonight's dinner were just picked in Riverside! Boy, are you really sure those aren't poisonous? Oh, that's what, uh... Sorry. Yeah, because again, everything we saw in Riverside was poisonous. Let's see if it'll let me through. Hello, Detective Mario! I guess we owe you again for getting us out of Riverside. This is your last night on the train, but please, have a good one, alright? Yep. Can't get it. Alright. Hey, mister. So, um, so, um, my, my mom and my dad, they said they're gonna get a, me a train set when we get to Poshley Heights. Can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Hello, Mr. Gonzalez. I've heard all about your present for little bump. You gave him the engineer's autograph, didn't you? I wish we'd thought of that. Gold Bob and I would so like to please him on his big day. Who knew my little bub liked trains so much? Perhaps I'll get him a solid gold train set when we get to Poshley Heights. Stop. Stop thinking in just gold. Just get him a good one. You can get him an intricate one. He'd really like an intricate one. But it doesn't need to be gold plated. Just stop. Good evening to you. Tomorrow's the day that our big deal goes down. I've checked the contracts. All that's left is to get a nice big breakfast tomorrow. On the expense account, of course. That's always the funniest thing in Japan, is when they're like, like, we gotta go on a business trip. Do we have to, sir? It's okay, for I have the company credit card! Whaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
rolling to Poshley Heights tomorrow. How was your Excess Express experience? I guess I don't even have to ask. You know why, sir? Because the Excess Express is fabulous! <laughs> what a goober. What? What a goober. Yeah. I don't know if we can, uh, again, we can't get inside the car. So, when it stops, when the train stops, I'm gonna try and leave the, go into the storage compartment. Or what hidden item are you talking about? Are you talking about the one in the, in the baggage compartment? Because we can't get in there yet. Woohoo! Tomorrow is finally Poshly Heights Day! We gotta get the Crystal Star before those other goons, no matter what! Let's catch some Z's before the big day, huh? Yes. With the main engine? We already got the... We ground pounded. Was there another item? Ah, morning of a new day. I love it. So cool and brisk, too. I love that. We ground pounded inside the main room. It was there. I'll check out there's another one. I'll check that email here in a second. Yeah, there's nothing here. Oh, good morning, sir. It's quiet. It's quite quiet this morning. What did you say? Hmm? Something on the windshield? Whoa! What? What are those things? Whoa, aren't those things... Wow, aren't those things from the station yesterday? They must have stowed away. What should I do? Uh, first, we have to ensure the passenger's safety. But I have to keep driving the train. Mario, can you check on the passengers? Uh, shit. Yeah, you need to slow the train down to a stop. Like, we can't, we obviously can't be, like, blitzing through. You have no idea what, what what's out there. He spoke it. What? I am. Um, there were a lot of black things everywhere. Did you save me? Wow. How goes the traveler? Welcome to the sales stall. We have lots of souvenirs. I do for you. Baggage. Spark, 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 spark. Oh, monsters are inside the train now. Let's get them. Oh, they have poor conductor. How horrible. Please help him. Out of here. Uh, Mario, you saved us again. Hey, I must have been taken by those black things while I was sleeping. Scary. They seem to came come into the baggage car through that open window. And they still have many of our paying passengers, all those poor souls. 
Uh, where exactly can I get on the pipe from? Oh, okay. Anywhere. Nice. Whoa! Get, get down! Get off the train! Off the train! Off the train! No, I'm not getting thrown off the train. You are. Get. Poverty. Poverty. I need you. Get him. Keep going, Poverty. Keep going. We must turn back the tide. I'm trying to find the leader. Over to go. Oh my god! Philip Thornton! What is that rank thing? Horrors! Mario, look! It's got the other passengers! Help! Ah! It's a Hydra! Well, the obvious, we have to, uh... Make sure she is 50, attack is 5, and defense is 1, and attacks with weird tentacles. Being the tentacles will drop the bodies, defense to 0, making it easier to attack. Tentacles will regenerate, but use that time to deal a ton of damage, okay? May also take other forms with higher attack powers. I don't really know. Let's just hurry and beat this thing down so we can save those trapped passengers. Ow. Fuck! You've been thunderstruck. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. Okay. Oh, it didn't do any damage. Okay.
Okay. Really? I just saw what the think game did. You suck, game. You fogged us right now. Gah. I can't believe this. That's some that's some epic bullshit. Of course, fog doesn't affect it. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I did it specifically to fuck me. Look at that. That is some cancer right there. be better here. Hmm. I, I literally can't believe we got fucked that hard. F fuck you. Nice to get. Yep. We literally got screwed on that one. to be kidding me. Have you ever seen the game give the middle finger this hard? Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Dark Souls is difficult but fair. That is just, that is utter, utter horseshit. Oh, attack power up, please. Ah, oh, we got six, six in though. That was a ton of damage. that damage.
get out of here. Oh. Get up yours. Holy crap, that fucking fog. That fog to screw us was just incredible. Oh. Thank you. Boy, it's like all you did for the three days was save us. How do we ever thank you? Everyone's safe now. It's all thanks to you! Oh, thank you much! You saved my life! No, stupid tongue of mine! You saved my life! So, did you all know this dashing fellow has been the famous Luigi all along? We'll soon arrive in Poshley Heights! Ladies and gentlemen, please prepare to disembark! Yeah, apparently toads can have hair. Hairy mushrooms. <laughs> Attention all passengers! Now arriving at Poshley Heights! Please watch your step and be sure to take all of your belongings with you! And thank you for choosing the Excess Express! We're finally here, Mario! Let's hurry up and find the Poshley Sanctum that the professor was talking about. What's our hair? Those are fungal roots. Ugh! Don't think about that. time until our next departure. Ah! What? <laughs> it kept, kept moving me. I kept trying to just jump straight up. The business people all waiting for haven't arrived yet. So I'm sightseeing. On the expense account, of course. As if you have to ask by now. Of course. Hey, mister, I'm gonna get a train set! The coolest one ever invented! I could just have them buy me a real train, but maybe I'll save that for next year. We dearly like to find a suitable present for little bub. You wouldn't happen to have a train set for sale, would you? A gold one, perhaps? <clears throat> this is so place so tiny! It's so small. Doesn't that look wrong right there? That line, that line, that seam? It's supposed to be a crack? Oh. Yeah, this is like super compact. Outside. Welcome, you marvelous man. The train journey certainly was thrilling, hmm? <clears throat> Where in the hell do you sleep at? Go up and use the ultra jump? Okay. Oh, I see. Ow. Nope. Maybe back here?
Okay, so yeah, I'll try ground pounding inside. Oh, here we go. Yeah! Hell yeah, found it. Oh, there's more! There's more! But wait! There's more! <clears throat> Alrighty. Oh, wait, wait, I see a thing. Hold on. Go back. point purpose of this I mean, we got sure we got the shard in here but why would you need this right hmm I don't understand Coupon! Yes. Yeah. It's a sort of fun to live here. But I can't eat snow cones or make little snowmen or go ice skating. Or any of the stuff I did in Shiver City, eh? Don't know what you got till it's gone. It's a lovely house, eh? Yeah, sure. Take your time to soak in all its majesty. I built it with even the smallest details in mind, making every nook special. Not only the interior, but the facade as well. Yeah, look around. Outside, too. Trains. Trains! <clears throat> what? Oh. Oh, yeah, the other ones do move, just, uh... Oh no, the Frenchman's here! <clears throat> All that for that. I can't even sleep at it. Yeah, where are the beds? Where are the bathrooms? I'm very worried. deep enough. <laughs> That's funny. Gone traveling. Sanctum manager. No way. That stinks. What now? Ah, oh, it's my dear Luigi. What are you doing at my doorstep, young fellow? 
Hmm. Hmm. Whoa! You live here? So you're the sanctum manager? Dude, I thought you were a detective. Well, yes. That's more like a hobby of mine, if the truth must be told. Explains why you're so bad at it. But enough, Chatter. Hmm? Shall we go inside? Too late. We gotta go after them. Just a second there, Luigi. Exactly what is going on here? Speak quickly. Uh -huh. Hmm, yes, quite rudimentary. So you were looking for the crystal star in the sanctum. Oh, ho, ho, ho. it's very interesting. Well, no cause for worry. Crystal star is safe. Yes, quite safe indeed. Stone that our rude friend stole was fortunately a red herring. A fake. Real one is hidden somewhere in this sanctum to prevent such a theft. However, as location of the real crystal star, well, as sanctum manager, I am of course prohibited from telling anyone. However, I do know where it is. Of that, you can be most certain. Yes, indeed. Besides, I am sure a junior detective like yourself could find it on your own. Now, Luigi, put to use all those razor sharp sleuthing skills I have taught you. Make me proud. You don't know where it is at all. What the hell is this? All right, maybe it's just telling you to you know jump up here. Hey, what's the other side? Oh, there's another thing over here. Okay. Hang on. So you do have to go that way first. You have to go that way first. Then you bring over here. Jump up there. Okay. Okay. I guess he's just up above, right? He seems like he's a person like that would do that. Okay, I can't go that way. So, up here. down this way. I bet you, maybe it's right underneath, it's in the pedestal or something, right? Oh no, it's behind the curtain. Wow. Let's find the other curtain then. <clears throat> Whee! I'm out in the painting, Ma! What? You got the crystal star. Star power is now seven, and now Mario can use the special attack showstopper. Man, I don't want that to be the end of the chapter. What's what else was in this room? There were secrets and shenanigans in here. 
hidden craftily in the partially hide sanctum. Only one crystal star remains. Hero still does not know where the Princess Peach is being held. Okay, I'm gonna hold here. I'm gonna start my lunch. I will be right back, chat. Still have this music to keep you company. B, or B. All right, I'm back. I'm just down here for a second. Lowering the desk. Okay. So in here in like uh, eight minutes, I'll have to go pick up the food from the air fryer. So there you go. Okay. And where is Peach being held? 
Hoping this crystal star might yield answers, Mario and friends return to Pennington. Yes. Alright, so it's gonna go to Peach, right? Oh, nice! We still get to do this! Heck yeah. I'll try and fight one of you. Ah, oh, it didn't work. I was trying to land on him. That is a lot. All right, let's see how this works. That's a dark boot. Purple just looks so wrong. Those are so creepy. XHP is eight, attack is five, defense is zero. Being attack are high, but they're just like the ordinary boos otherwise. Just attack it like a normal boo. Get it before it turns invisible. You little shite. Okay. Beats your enemies with a single blow when successful. Okay, no foes to hammer. You can ice smash. I guess technically because they're not on the ground at all. Well. can. Oh! Coops can indeed hit both. Alright. That'd be worth it, though. Alright. So Coops can hit both. However, we want Drake out. Just checking if certain attacks will be possible, right? Again, we need to investigate how we're gonna fight all these boos. <clears throat> one! One HP! Don't you dare do it. Don't you dare do it. Okay, good. Alright, so Drake doesn't do enough damage. So we need to keep uh, Goombella out. Yeah, they give decent uh, star. They give decent uh, star points, star coins. Yeah. And it'll give time for myself to cook. God, there's only two. Yeah, and I'll go grab my uh, stuff in the air fryer here very shortly.
Oh, missed. Fuck. Oh, there's only one boo. Okay. Fuck! Oh. Shit. Might be able to get another level up in this room, maybe. See how many boos are left. Gotcha! Oh! We won! We won in the opening! This is the last one. Shit. Oh, well, 70. 70 is not bad. That's pretty nice. Yeah. Okay. We must go deeper. world hey yep there's a badge over there oh and a shine sprite hell yeah punk hell yeah Oink. all right what you got for me change Mario's clothes into Luigi's clothes oh <gasps> That's the best one. Oh, shit. There we go. <laughs> Alright, anyways. Back to normal. Okay, so. Um, let's get the HP plus. Mario up to the 30, right? Yeah, 30. Oh, it doesn't auto-heal us. Fuck. That's fine. Alright, give me one second, chat. I'm gonna go grab the air fryer food. It should be ready by now.
So, so yeah, it has been a uh, good day today. Woke up and found out that Disney got BTFO'd in their lawsuits. They got utterly fucking destroyed. It's great. Probably, um... I don't know, I'll have to look more into it. Maybe we'll talk about tomorrow in full detail. But I know, like, some of the basic stuff. They've lost Reedy Creek. They've lost the rights to the power plant. Uh, it's going to be renegotiated. It's probably going to renegotiate it with the power plant directly. Which is going to cut Disney out of tens of millions of dollars. So, the, the estimate was $30 million to $50 million, somewhere in there. So there you go. There's another source of revenue completely gone. Um... They uh, admitted to doing illegal business activities. So there's also probably criminal uh, cases coming soon against Disney. I, again, this is all in the settlement, by the way. Like, this is stuff they've agreed to. Stuff they've admitted now on record. <clears throat> so, yeah, there's a bunch of stuff. I would love to... I'll have to go through that. Okay, the dumplings are a bit too hot right now. Woo! Gotta let them cool down a bit. Hmm. So that is where it was. Oh, uh, nothing. Nothing. I'm just talking to my brain. All geniuses do it. Congratulations, Luigi. You have found the real crystal star. <clears throat> so please, feel free to take it. Uh, I will just put another fake one over here. Well, traveling with you has been rather hectic, but I do admit rather fun as well. I'm sure you still have a long road ahead of you, Luigi. But do not give up. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Oh. the matter with you idiots falling for a fake crystal star that's asinine sorry dude i mean sir so let me guess this means mario managed to get the real crystal star uh i'm gonna say maybe oh, this mustache of menaces nearly every crystal star now they were mine i think i'd better alter my plan a bit uh, before you do, Sir Grotus, I think I'd better tell you something. What is it, fool? <clears throat> what? Are you sure? Speak. Uh, no joke, dude. I mean, affirmative, sir, dude. That is, I'm positive, sir. Hmm. Treason. Uh oh. Isn't it about time for Tech to call me? Him? Maybe he's busy. Oh. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> Princess, I shall soon be dead. I need you as my last dying wish. today <clears throat> princess peach i have i have reached a conclusion a uh, conclusion i have struggled with whether to obey orders or to speak to you and i cannot confirm what i should believe tech you don't sound right what's going on with you princess peach please escape from this place as quickly as possible Escape? Tech? What do you mean? By what? By that? I mean, why all of a sudden? The data you procured has been analyzed, and something terrible is... No, I will not say. But I have found out everything about Sir Grotus's plans. Grotus's plans? You mean about conquering the world? 
Yes, and among those plans was the reason why you are being held here. According to the data. No, no way. It's impossible. I don't believe it. <clears throat> yes, everything is true. That is why you must escape from here as soon as possible. How can I do that, Tech? I mean, I don't even have the slightest idea where I am. I will not hide anything anymore. No, not from you. I will tell you everything. The place where you are currently in prison. This is the moon. The, the moon? You mean the moon that hangs up in the sky at night? That moon? That is correct. But that's unbelievable. How in the world am I supposed to escape? There is a way. You can escape, but you must follow my instructions exactly. But, Tech, won't they know that you help me? Won't you get in trouble? That is inconsequential. I would like you to be safe. That is all that matters. <clears throat> Tech! I am the basis computer. No one will know of your escape if I keep it silent. Please do not worry about me. Escape. Escape as quickly as possible. Okay, Tech. But I must inform Mario about all this before I go. So no longer just my problem. Understood. Hold it right there, princess. It, you! <clears throat> Tech, you miserable machine. We all know what you're up to, traitor. Sir Grotus, I... In my most paranoid moments, I never thought my own computer would betray me. Well, it doesn't really matter in the end. I suppose, especially since it ends here. You monster! What are you planning to do with him? <laughs> Only one thing to do with a malfunctioning computer. Cut the circuit and delete all the programs and data that caused the malfunction. Obviously, all data relating to Princess Peach must go as well. Yes, we must be absolutely sure nothing like this ever happens again. No, I am. I am normal. There is no malfunction. <clears throat> Pipe down, Tech. X dots. At the same time, press the red buttons on Tech's side. Got it, sir. Tech, no! Mail sent. I just love you. Deletion complete. <laughs> Too bad, Princess Peach. Tech is no longer with us. No, you inhuman beast! How could you? Princess Peach, just stop it. This is no time to be worrying about a computer. We have some very important things for you to do now. Yes, very important. No! Go! <laughs> All right, let's check in with the actual main character. <clears throat> oh, he's back in Rogueport. Bruh. Bruh. I've got no crystal stars. I can't find Princess Peach. Twilight Town was, well... Wasn't exactly glorious. What's going on here? This keeps up. Mario's gonna steal everything from my grasp, as usual. Your massiveness! <clears throat> Fuck! <clears throat> Throat demons! Ah! We did it! The Magic Koopa Scouts found a suspicious underground chamber! This isn't even on any maps! Yeah, really suspicious! 
Something must be there. Hmm. About time. Well done. This is where it all turns around for me. Definitely. The Hammer Bros Battalion is attempting to breach the chamber at the moment. The area is impenetrable. They're scraping tooth and nail in there. No problem. Direct me there. I'll blast us through. I'm Bowser, baby. Bowser bathes in lava. Why would he care about... Mushrooms, meat. Eat big old chunks of meat. Incredible, Lord Bowser! Nothing stood in your way! You couldn't be more super! <laughs> Please! No problem. Felt right at home. But where are we now? Gracious me, look! Lord Bowser! On the wall behind you! <clears throat> Hello, could it be? Ah, yeah, a crystal star. Advantage, Bowser. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> At last, we found one, and now we'll make it ours. Freeze, chumps. Oh, yeah. Gruff, who's there? <laughs> Don't tell me you don't know the famous Rockhawk! You little punk weasel. You forgot these muscles? You forgot this hugeness? Don't ask me how, but you cleared my secret training facility. Not too shabby. I even imported some super freaks to up the difficulty level. You're good. Of course, good don't count for squatting this biz, babe. My champ belt's mine! <laughs> oh, look, what an adorable little weakling. Hi, fella. Weak? What? Wait, what? Well, tell me something. You ever see weakling do this? <clears throat> oh! Pain! A Ouch! <laughs> oh, now you're sleeping. I knew you were a weakling. Whoa! Crystal Star! Hmm! It! It split in two! Oh no, 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 no! Wait! Hold the phone! My mighty Lord Bowser! This is just glass! It's a flip flam! A fake! What? Speak English! You. Ah! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Want the real one! The great Gonzalez has it. Oh, my aching hair. Feel the rock. I don't know anybody named Gonzalez. Stop speaking in riddles, you chicken nugget. Crud. Who do I have to flatten to get a crystal star? Who? Who?
crushing rock hock brings me joy. <laughs> Mario, I now know where I'm being held. I'm on the moon. Yes, the moon that floats out in space. And I've learned something even more horrifying. In order to resurrect the monster spirit, they need my body. Body. The moon? That's totally nuts. Princess Peach is on the moon? I mean, that actually sounds pretty cool, but why is her email cut off? Oh my gosh, you don't think something happened to her, do you? Nice. Hang on a second. How are you, Mario? This is Eve from Twilight Town. Remember me? After a lot of soul searching, I've found that I'm truly happy. I may not be able to forget the hard times or even completely remember them, but. I've been thinking things over, and I believe that my sad past paved the way to my current happiness. Is that deep? Anyway, I can think about that stuff all the time. Kids play all day, then they get hungry and cry and scream, so I'm pretty busy all day, every day. Kids would love to see you again, so please drop by next time you're in the area. On the yours, Eve. Okay. Alright, All right, let, me, let me eat at least one of these burritos. Er... So technically the chimichangas, but you know. Mmm, 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 tasty. Ah, tasty, good, delicious. in Rapture's Ruins, bro. Yep, a marvelous compass piece. This part of my adventure was actually sort of sad, if you want to know the truth. It was pretty insane, bro. Want to hear what happened? It's a pretty long story. It sounds good to me. Which part of my story you want to hear, bro? <clears throat> well, like I said, it's a, pretty, it's a really long story, but here it goes. After journeying deep into the Grimble Forest, I found the domed Rapture's Ruins. Inside, everything was pure white. You couldn't tell where the floor became walls. Proceeding dead ahead, I found myself in a chamber where a young boy sat. As I approached the boy, someone named Screamy appeared out of nowhere. Screamy said the boy's name was Cranberry, and that he'd wake for a child of fate. It didn't make any sense to me, so I started searching quietly for the compass piece. Then it happened, bro. I got a tiny tickle in my nose, and I let out a huge sneeze. But Cranberry must have heard it. Because he opened his eyes right up. He looked at me and smiled. And all of a sudden, I could understand his language. Can you believe it? I learned that the boy was the last of an ancient race, the Loofs. He had been there guarding the marvelous compass piece for the last thousand years. He told me that the compass is an item with power to see into the future. The ancient Loof Empire used the power of the compass to rule much of the world. Because of their greed... They were cursed by the compass, and their empire collapsed. To prevent a repeat of their fate, Cranberry broke the compass into seven parts. He had all six and kept one, putting himself to sleep until a worthy hero woke him. I was that hero, bro. He gave it to me, and then he and the ruins vanished. When I added that piece of the compass, it pointed to the far north where dreaded Hate Song Tower stands. This time I heard Princess Eclair's voice more clearly than ever before. I'll rescue the princess. I will be super, and then I'll... I'll... Well, I'll figure the rest out later. Anyway, I headed back here to Rogueport after that. Making my final preparations for my final battle now. I'm a little nervous, bro. But that's what I've been up to anyway. Woo! Wanna hear what I've been up to? Just come find me, okay? I'll be around. I'm Screamy. I wonder what future is plotted for us by he who holds the compass. For I must deliver something. Okay. Oh 
no! Wait. I know where I know where Shine Sprite is. I didn't want to go back. I didn't want to go back, but they're taking me back anyways. more hot dogs. I don't want the hot dogs. Oh, that nerd's here. are great IRL, but man. I'll see what the thing is on it again. 5 HP, 5 FP. That's, yeah, that's not too bad. I'll keep it. Gross IRL, you haven't had a proper hot dog. Oh, they are so good. Mm -hmm. I'm going to. Yeah, cheap hot dogs are gross. yourself a chili dog though oh proper chili dog oh <laughs> yep or the air fryer oh my god the air fryer works so well for hot dogs holy shit it can it depends on how you boil them like you if you stick them in a pot of water right that sucks but if you do only a half bit of water and in like a pan and you mix it with butter and spices and things like that, oh, oh, that's a good way to boil them. However, air fryer does it better. Do the air fryer. Air fryer just does it way better. Way better. Mm -hmm. So the way I do it is I will put all the hot dogs in the pan, right? And then with the hot dog package itself, I will fill it up with water and dump it in the pan. And that will bring it up to be about halfway, halfway to it, um, halfway to the, the top of the hot dogs. And then you'll, uh, from there, put in butter your salts and peppers and things like that. Oh, get some bit of garlic in there. Just, whoo, super tasty. Hmm. Gotta have the salt in there too. Gotta have the salt. Ooh, Ultra Hammer! Hell yeah!
the last time I get to see you, Mario. Definitely save Princess Peach, okay? And be careful on your quest, okay? Yeah, she's sad now. Hey! I know uh, quite a few of these fucking spots, so let's go, uh, let's go get them right now. Hey, just because she doesn't have hair like everyone else doesn't mean she's mentally ill, okay? Right. Oh! I can just smash it! Smash it! Cold. Where is this place anyway? We're in the Shiver place. Shiver City, right? Oh, another shine sprite. Whoa! one of these guys. Can I jump that? Or will that hurt? I need to test it. Alright, sorry, uh, sorry, Drake, but we do need to test it. Okay, you cannot. Got it. Give me an attack boost now. Really? You goofball. What? They didn't let me they didn't let me bounce off of him. Like no. There we go. Looks like they have like nine health or ten health. I 
feel like I've gone to an area I'm not supposed to be in. Like, I feel like I've jumped the gun quite significantly. realized that guy would have charged me 36 for a shooting star thing wow con man absolute con artist all right i feel like that cannon gets me to the moon or something right so I gotta get back to Rogue Port. up to 30 might be good here get up to 30 flower points again give us more chance to use our west of He was low on the ground, wasn't he? Oh, fuck. <clears throat> oh, fuck. That's not good. Well, let's see what this is. So many coins! So many coins! Okay. Hang on, we got so many coins, I'm just gonna go back and uh, rest. Get all of our FP back. Uh, 
welcome to in. Da, I'll stay. You have in coupon? Use it. Have good sleep. Da. Oh! Your sleep good, da? Enjoy day. Space food! Made by Zest Team. Punch is 5 HP. Yeah, so this is definitely a. Uh, we're going. We're going to the moon with the cannon here, I bet. Alright. Let's go get all the other stuff in the underground. Close. Woo! Woo! I have to start asking folks if they like bananas. What? You like bananas? Yeah. I mean, what's a better source of potassium? Um. Go this way. You know what? What do you have? I've got tons of star shards. What do you have? Boost your partner's attack by one. Another one. That's really fucking good. Boost partner attack. Always good. And then, let's do flower saver on Mario. Okay. Let's readjust our badges. Okay. So. We're gonna ice smash. Tornado jump was okay. Damage dodge, get rid of. Flower save requires four. We're missing this one? Really? Hold on. We have another power plus. We have two. Wait. There we go. Yeah, okay, we need a lot more. Got it. <clears throat> Four for that. Spike shield's too handy. That gives five. Take you off. Take off that. Another power plus. Okay. There we go. So now Mario is even more powerful than he was. All right, we're going to have to uh, do 
do some shenaniganry. Okay. Yeah, now there should be a thing over here, right? Yeah, here we go, a pipe. So there's two ways to go. First off, we're going this way. I'm gonna put Bovary down. I don't know if it'll work, because this one doesn't have the crack that the other side did. Yeah! Nice. <clears throat> huh. Okay, now... Quite a distance. Oh, woo! We almost didn't make that. Oh. What? Who's place is this? And get more badge points. I can see why people do super badge heavy though. Holy crap. You get real strong real fast. Okay, um, I need to go down here. That's nice. Okay. Alright, so this should take us to... One of these should be Keel Hall, I think. And one of these should be Blitzville, maybe? Oh, there's Keel Hall. Yeah, nice. <clears throat> Or pipes. Are you gonna be Glitzville? Oh no, it's Posh! Oh. Interesting. What's in here? What? Ah, oh, I missed. Six? Yeah. We're just clearing out a bunch of areas now. Because we've got new tech. Ooh, hello. Ooh. Wait. Did I come in this way? 
Hold on. I don't remember how, because it's been so long since we've been in here. What is with you and toilets? Something about toilets. It's weird. I see you, you little shit. was charging his hammer. He's gonna throw it at me. <clears throat> I like toilet lunches. Where the fuck did you get I like toilet lunches? Screens. Yeah, I did the because if I go to the bathroom a lot. Remember, I have IBS. Four hundred is too much money. Well, I haven't found anything good to spend it on. to go to the toilet and get lunch at the same time. Toilet lunch. What? That's just being fucking efficient. If I have to go to the bathroom and we're near lunchtime, I might as well go make lunch, too. Instead of coming back saying, alright, guys, I'm back from the toilet. Now I'm gonna go make lunch. Got it. goes by pretty quick. I gotta do it when it's coming back this way. Yeah! Alright, defense by one. Okay. That wasn't really worth it, but three shine sprites? Absolutely worth it. Pianta tokens to spend on even more badges? Okay. Okay. 
I guess I can see what badges they have. What I need the most right now are star points. Star points are life. Star points are love at the moment. <clears throat> I mean, I can get more batch points. Gotcha, you little shit. Coming up to the end game. Oh, yeah, I could go do the pit. here. <clears throat> Alright, let's see what these guys have. Oh, I don't know. Like, Again, I wanted to do Itiko's bounty this week, but because of his uh, schedule, we're going to change it a bit. And we're going to try and get his bounty in uh, next week. He just needs to leave me his schedule so I know when to start it. <clears throat> and we're going to go from there. I have a super shroom. Not an ultra shroom, though. But super shroom. Let's uh, let's do super shroom. All right, let's see. What can you make, Gus? Okay, so that does not this is not benefit. So don't do super shrooms that. Just do normal shrooms. Okay. All right. Now you said the Pianta Parlor. It's over there. worth it. That's not even good badges in there. Alright. I feel like I've got all the really good badges. <clears throat> Alright. 
Well, again, now we've got so many of these, let's just start leveling up our characters, too. You can get two of them up to uh, second tier already. Of these, which ones? Which ones do you think? Of the ones that are left, what ones do you think I should upgrade? I'm thinking Vivian and Miss Mouse. <clears throat> but does Flurry have something really good at, high, at the high tiers? Excuse me. Okay. Yeah, I'll do Vivian and Miss Mouse then. So Vivian, you can use Infatuate to confuse all enemies. Okay, let's do Miss Mouse real quick. <clears throat> I'm gonna switch to that. So literally any shy sprites we get from now on will go towards Flurry. Smooch to boost Mario's HP. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, the Yoshi's one. Stampede is ridiculously strong. And I'm gonna get more badge points so that way I can get um Get more badge points. That way, I can actually get uh, uh, Stampede to do even more damage. Well, it'll be one more, but still, that combined with the uh, the buff from Power Lift, oh, that'll be enough. So I need to go. couple of the super jump sprites. Not that I'm super interested in getting Flurry all the way up. I guess I'll be farming in the snow fields anyways to get some extra badge points and stuff. Oh, and we're gonna go do the we're gonna go do the challenge, right? Yeah, that's right. do that real quick <clears throat> does it keep us does it keep progress where we were because we made it to what floor 20 or does it start us all over if it starts all over that's gonna suck Whoa! Woo! I made it! 
Okay. Yeah, I'll try to grab some movers then. I'll grab movers until we get up to the floors we haven't seen yet. Fire flower. That come in handy to deal with a uh, big horde. Yeah. As I said, if I find them, I'll, I'll grab them. <clears throat> we'll we'll see. Um. Yeah. You know what? I don't want to waste. Them. Our points on this. Neat. Neat. get our flower points back up a bit because I was silly and didn't rest before we did this but that's okay Drop me that fire flower, that'd be nice. Oh, bummer. Ah, oh, dang it. <clears throat> Wrong way. Ah, oh, I didn't get the save on that one that time. sad we haven't gotten a single of uh, the uh, movers yet would have been real nice would have been real nice
the situations we're in right now. Thank you, take you. Oh, good morning, Rockbar. Oh, I missed. Okay. Ooh. Please, give me that badge. You know you want to. Yeah, I know. So much monies. We'll get there eventually. We'll get there. Oh, nice. A mover. Mover. A few things about getting through this dungeon. A few coins. Let's go down five levels, baby. Oh, I was trying to reflect it back. Silly me. Oh, come on! I jumped the moment I had control. Okay, 
down to 20. And here's this goober. Um, sure, I've got plenty of money. That's five more of the uh, one attacks, so. There we go. Oh, shit. Okay. Down we go. <clears throat> oh, why was I looking that way? <laughs> oh, I tried. Wow, that didn't actually work. Interesting. Oh, that didn't connect, damn. No, you serious? Ah, oh, missed my one. <clears throat> Thank goodness we actually hit. Yeah, so I can do the quake camera ten more times <clears throat> because of flower saver. I just five per. Nice! Yeah, I can't really fast finger with my right pointer, but my middle finger on oh, the right hand just nails it. Nails it on the trigger. Woo! 
Hell yeah. <clears throat> Come on, baby. We need them star points. I'm gonna try with my pointer finger now. It just does not feel comfortable. Yeah, man, my middle finger does way better. <clears throat> Is there a candy you love to swallow? What the fuck? Oh, of course it is that! I guess the... If I had to answer it honestly, um, it'd probably be uh, the Warheads uh, popping candy. Not Warheads themselves. There's another variant of them. Which is just, they're a powdery uh, version. They're kind of like Pop Rocks, but uh, in Warheads uh, flavor instead. Very tasty. Kind of, but they've got the sourness and they crackle and pop like Pop Rocks do. Oh. Nope. I am very specifically talking about Warheads. They've got a new, uh, it's new for them. Oh, I didn't get the defense on it. Yeah, recruit. Yeah, we were talking about it. And the boat was... No, they didn't have a local uh, harbor mast there to help guide them, which is a big no-no. And it was all... All of them were foreigners. Like, hmm. Doesn't look good, let's put it that way. What? No, fuck you. <clears throat> What? Are you kidding me? Only did four. I'm gonna do- I'm just gonna do Stampede. It missed! It missed! fog. Swear to God, I hope, I hope fog never shows up in any of the rest of the Super Mario, the Paper Mario games. It is one of the biggest middle fingers there is. Oh, <laughs> more rewards! <clears throat> Take your rewards! Ooh! Got the badge. Pretty lucky P. No, I haven't. Never even heard of him. Yeah, or as we like to call it, it was a mistake. We're not dealing with them summoning a bunch of fucking spinies and shit like that. Nope. Fuck that. Nipping that right in the bud.
I have no idea why I can do the middle finger so much faster on the right hand. It is so much faster. Oh, but I missed. Yeah, double stylish. Double stylish on a jump. Fuck yeah. <clears throat> Demons are trying to win again. Hey, we made it. Floor 30. Do damage enemies that touch Mario in battle. What you got? What you got? Thank you. We got plenty of monies, so... Worried. I'm not worried about it at all. Not worried at all. Koopas! Koopas! I was gonna say, you better knock him over at least. Ah! Oh. <laughs> oh, dang it. I would take a drink. I shouldn't have done that. Star points, please! Please! Oh, hell yeah! Hang me down, five levels, baby! Shenanigan Reese. Shenanigans! <laughs> Shenanigans! Too emotional. He was flying. <laughs> yeah, full heal, baby. Oh my 
god. Oh, shit. Thirty-nine, baby! Come on! Forty! Hell yeah. Those movers. Those movers are the best. <clears throat> those movers are the best. Occasionally recover one FP. Alright, let's get up to 50. Come on, baby! Oh, come on! Oh. You son of a bitch! Let me knock you down. <laughs> oh, come on! Gonna get rid of him. And knock him down. He's still alive? There we go. Double stylish off of him, at least. He was still alive! They shot him six times and he's still alive! <clears throat> Woo! Hello there! Honestly, more threatening. The spiny is more threatening. Or the... The... Spiky, Pokey. Whatever. I can't remember his name. Pokey's more threatening. Oh, come on! Shenanigans! You know what? Let's swap to Gumbella. <clears throat> And not because I want the enemy, but because her, uh, her thing is a lot easier than cop and go with the, <laughs> with the trigger. I mean, you can't do anything to this one. Maybe you could kill the other one? Yeah! Oh, titty sprinkles. Kill it! Kill it quick! It's growing too large! <clears throat> Hi, baby. Hell yeah. Now we're starting to get the points. Now we're getting the points. And now we'll start getting the levels. Oh, I should have jumped on him. My jump does more damage. Oh! It was still just enough damage anyways. Oh, he had a revive shroom. Wow, interesting. 
That was an interesting story there, Senator. But, uh, I think you're dead. What? Okay. <laughs> that was... Ah, oh, I wish I had gotten the double bonk, but I didn't. Free uh, quake hammer. now. Fuck! Ah! Oh. I need to learn the timing on that. Tattle for me. <clears throat> well, I'm the flame spear. Is six. Attack is four. And defense is zero. Each attack power may be different from any ember, but otherwise it's the same. Made of fire. Try not to touch it because it'll burn you. Apparently, it's vulnerable to explosions and ice attacks. Oh, and if you get hit by a flame attack, you might catch fire. So guard well. Speaking of. What a dick. Eight. We were one shy. One shy. And what floor are we at? 45. We're getting there. Oh, come on! I feel like that's, like, designed specifically to fuck me over. Um... You know what? We just need the one, so... damage. I know, fog. Fog is so awful of a mechanic. I hate it. I hate it. <clears throat> still leveled up, baby. You tried, game. You tried to fuck me. And I still came out on top. Battle Mario's crowd and stage get even bigger! Ooh, nice. We're an A-lister now, baby!
this we need we need another badge point so we can put this in is there anything I want to put in right now though that's the question chance that's the happy flower off chance we get uh, some back right Oh, I should have done the rally. What was I thinking? Yeah, we should have done the rally. Because then I could have done this again. Oh! It would have been nice if you did this to me the first time. Not this time. scum and villainy. See, there you go. See? Just getting back that little bit helps. So I wish I got more star points, but... Man, oh man, fire enemies. Fire enemies are awful. Not yet. We're almost there. Camera. All that camera was trying to do there. Yes, that's we made fun of him yesterday for that. John Stewart, uh, for anyone that doesn't know, um, John Stewart 
went on his big, usual Trump derangement syndrome rant, right? His usual, uh, fucking authoritarian fascist bootlicking. And then, it got revealed that Mr. Jon Stewart did the exact thing that he was complaining that Trump did. Oh, wow. We got a fucking a Democrat bootlicker being a massive fucking hypocrite and projecting. Oh, say it ain't so. Yeah, so that's been, uh, that was fun. That was funny to see. And his response was to then go on another Trump derangement syndrome rant and be like, Oh, no, I, I did one of the things. I gotta do all the other stuff about that Trump did. And he's like, that Trump didn't do. Good job, dumbass. Item that lets you carry up to 20 items. What the f I like it. Yeah, okay, I like it. Doubles your item inventory. Hell yeah. Stockpile, baby. Oh, no. Probably this kills the guy immediately. No, it does not. That's not a good sign. Badge Bandit? Oh. Come on. Neither of those? Neither of those got it? Does multi bonk hit both foes? Oh, no, it just hits one foe. Got it. Ah! You little shite. Those guys hurt. Dirty little thieves. Dirty little thieves! For anyone that doesn't know, he overvalued his property by 829%. So, as everyone said, we look forward to seeing you in uh, court, John. Right? That's... Oh, wait a minute. No, this is entirely a politically motivated stunt to get Trump. It had nothing to do with actual law because, again, nobody was victimized at all. Ah! Didn't get it. Man, I can't wait to get the partner uh, upgrade. So the partners do more damage. That way they can one-shot those guys too. It'd be real nice. There we go. Missed the first one. I can get the heal. Man, oh man, can I not get the, uh... Yeah! I can get the heal, but man, can I not get the, um... Flower points or the star one at all.
Dang! That does way more damage. Okay. Oh, come on! I was swinging the hammer! Ow! Dick! Dick! Ow. Oh! Oh, I didn't get either of them. Fucking hell. floor are we at now? 54. Okay. There we go. Hot dogs, baby. Yeah, you know, hot dogs might be the way to go. Gotcha! Not today! Not this time! Not in this place! <laughs> Not in this house! Man! Oh. Alright! Floor 56! Here we go! No! Not one of these again! Ah! Oh, shit, literally stole my badge. Here, give me my badge back, you son of a bitch. Ow! Thank god I didn't get frozen. I was frozen today! Badge thieves, man. Yeah! Try to steal it from me, you asshole. <laughs> Alright, it's 56, right? Yep, 57. Here we go. I don't think I can take. I can't take. This is so boring. Going all the way down here this is awful. Oh, Jesus. That's not a good sign. Oh, come on. I didn't get either of them. After this uh, next one. <laughs> At least we got the doubles our uh, item count. That was good.
Once we hit the floor 60, we'll, uh, we'll dip. there though we're getting there in terms of levels and everything look how much money we have too good lord oh no direct try to bite me doggy for it didn't work red chomp rabbit red biting chewing chomping fool HP is six attack is five and defense is three this attack is so powerful we could be in a world of hurt if we don't beat it fast which is why it's really, really lame that its defense is so high. HP is pretty low, though, so uh, items and special moves might just work. Let's look at that color. Think someone painted it after it fell asleep at a party? Gotcha! Audience tried to interfere, jumping in the way of the camera. They could not save the chompy. The chain chomp must die. All right, good. Floor 60. Get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Oh, there's 40 more floors to go. I'm out. I'm out, peace. It's just too much. this matters, I just realized. I mean, I guess we can do the story stuff, right? That's gonna come up right now, so we'll do the story thing, and then we'll be set for next time. Go into the final chapter. Yeah, so we'll should finish off uh, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door tomorrow. Should. We'll see. Beating spaghetti, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> We're going to the moon! That's what's happening. That's what's going to happen next time. Uh, okay, that's it. Like, uh, total typo or something. 
Do you see that, Mario? The last crystal star. It can't be there. Yeah, of course it is. What this map indicates is true. Location of the final crystal star is... The moon! The moon? Princess Peach is there too. Like, uh, this just seems wrong on, like, so many levels. Mm. The problem here is, how does one get to the moon? Quite a conundrum. Give me a moment to look into this. Excuse me, please. This shouldn't take long. We're going to the Babam village. We're going to shoot ourselves with a cannon. Betcha, I bet you that's what I ran into. Mm. Looking into this may take a little bit of time, so come back in a bit, alright? The mail. The mail stops for no one. Yeah, we made it to floor 60, Neanderthal, and I was just like, I can't, I can't take it. I can't take it. It's too it's too much. rip me off. Okay. It is a very long dungeon. It, it would help if, like, hey, once you get to floor 50 or something like that, it'd be like, hey, here's a checkpoint. Right? I mean, like, that'd be so nice. That'd be so nice. Alright. Anyways, chat. Once again, I want to thank you all very much for tuning in. It is greatly, greatly appreciated, as always. Oh, my goodness sakes. We are... Uh, should be in the final chapter tomorrow, so it should be the final Paper Mario Thousand Year Door stream tomorrow. But, yeah, that'll be, uh, that'll be interesting. Hopefully, I'll see you guys there for that. And remember, this Saturday, in two days, two days, we will be watching... Um, Robocop 3, which I've never seen before, and I've heard it's not good. So it should be interesting. It should be an interesting experience. Now, I will see you guys tomorrow, and uh, next week we'll be starting Itiko the Tricky's Bounty, who wants to do Harmony of Dissonance. So that'll be the game we'll be playing next week. We'll also be switching in between it and Terraria and Arch Thrones. So, you know, it'll be a bit, a bit mixed in there. Yeah. Until tomorrow, guys, we take care. Have a fantastic day. Stay safe and healthy. Get fit, get ripped. And I will see you tomorrow. Buh bye bye. Goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye.